Yo, what's up? It's your boy Franchise Todd. What's the game to you, Lost? Welcome to the Stories Podcast. We got a very special guest here. You go by the name of Flawless Victory. Hey, Flawless in the building, baby. Yo, we got Flawless on our show coming up on October 26th. It's Halloween Madness, a night on Main Street, and he's definitely the headliner. Yo, Flawless, tell him a little bit about yourself. Hey, man, it's your boy Flawless, man. First City King, and we about to show y'all how we do it in First City, baby. You know what I mean? It's not a gang. It's the real deal, and I guarantee you, we the ones that sparked this Midwest movement. You hear what I'm talking about? Let's get it. When did you start rapping, man? Man, uh, when I was born, you know what I mean? I came out the vagina rapping, on, I'm pretty sure, you know what I mean? <laughs> but uh, I did my first little show, uh, I was probably like eight or nine, you know what I mean? Little really? talent show. <laughs> yeah, little shit. Really? Won that one, killed him, you know what I mean? <laughs> did the next one, killed him. After about four of them and winning them trophies, they was like, just come to perform. You ain't even in the town. So you had no stage fright from the beginning? <laughs> no. Nah, actually, I always did. I was actually very scared. You know what I mean? Yeah. It took a partner to kind of push me to do it. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what it took. And I appreciate it. Roderick, Twan, you know what I mean? Troy Noka, I appreciate that, bro. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So growing up, man, who influenced you in your music? Man. Everybody before 2002, you know what I mean? <laughs> we talking about the, uh, yeah, your Snoops and your Bun B's, your M&M's, man, your Pac, of course, you know what I mean? Uh, Biggie, you know what I mean? All the greatest, the ones that's, the same ones that inspired y'all, same ones that inspired me, man, yeah. you know what I mean? Which one of them artists um, kind of like you resemble in your music a little bit? Uh, See, I take a little bit of everybody, but Bone. Yeah. You know what I mean? Bone, the, you know, that's Midwest to the fullest. Bone, <laughs> Twister. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? Something about being able to spit it that fast, but still be saying something and do something to you, you know? Yeah. And that's who inspired me probably the most. I say Bone and Twister, man. Let's, yeah. talk, let's talk about your um, your recent project, My Name is Earl. Yeah. What's, um, what's your favorite track from that joint? My name is Earl. <laughs> it probably be see. I, that's one of those uh, albums where it's like a TV show. Though. You know, it just so happened. My name is Earl is a TV show, yeah. and it fits because his concept of the show fit with the album. Yeah, you know I mean, it was just meant to be. But uh, she don't know. It's a song where uh, I'm talking to the women. I think that's the one that kind of hits them hard because I put a lot of thought into that. Little spoken word, and then we jump back into the rap. You know what I mean? But I'm letting women know yeah. how how men really see you, cause you know what I mean. You hear that other nonsense on the the music today, but I gave them the truth real quick. Let me just put it like that. Y'all need to check that out. Yeah, definitely. Um, what's your um, process of making music? Man, like, how do you get in the studio? Like, do you um, just write it all in your head? Do you write it down and then attack it? With me, uh, I started off uh, freestyle, but uh, somebody made me uh, kick that. It was like, you got to start writing. And since then, I kind of attack it both ways. It was like, when you hear the beat, something take over me. So the freestyle kick in, and that's getting the melody to the chorus. And then once I got the concept, yeah. then it's the bars. Then I really focus in on it, get the writing. Yeah, but it, it kind of just take over me because every beat I hear is telling me something. So yeah. it's almost like I ain't really writing it. I'm just repeating what that beat told me to say. I mean, yeah. if, if you could put your um, music in like a category, what would you put it in? Category in hip hop. Today, it would be in that Kendrick J. Cole category. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah it, I'm, I'm with them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, um, shout your social medias out, man. Let people know where you at. Flawless Earl everything. Flawless, E-A-R-L, one word, everything. You know what I mean? If you're on Facebook, Real Flawless. And uh, YouTube, Flawless Earl everything, man. Check me out. First City. Yeah.